Alright, so, Taverns of Tiefen Tor. The objective of the game is to attract the best guests with your nice pub and lots of beer. Uh, the way you do this is by essentially drawing cards, which will get you gold and beer by putting dice on. What you're going to do is everyone will simultaneously draw cards from the deck and place them in the appropriate place in the tavern. Once all your tables are full, you stop drawing. Okay, so here, all those tables full, stop. You can buy more tables, so if I drew another table, and I got another guest, that's another table, you get the idea. I would then stop. <coughs> Once you've finished, you roll your dice. You take one, and then pass them to the right. Or pass them to the left, or pass them to the right, swap each round, basically. Then you take another dice, pass them on, take one, pass them until you're left with just one dice and you take that one. Then you assign where you want the dice to go, and where you assign the dice will get you different amounts of gold and beer. So guests will give you gold for numbers. So these guests will give me two gold for twos. Uh, this, these guests will give you one gold for ones. With gold, there isn't like a physical representation of it. You have to spend it. It's use it or lose it. You do. You can store some in your vault just at the bottom here to a maximum of two, but you can upgrade your storage. The same applies for beer. Maximum of two, but you can upgrade the storage. Um, for beer, you have this keg here, which will one time take any number, give you one beer. Or this brewer, who for one or a six, as many times as you like, will get you one beer okay. for each of this and the card you've got. So, for example, if I had, oh, pretend these are ones, that would be four beer, because it's two, and I've got this card, which is another two beer, because of the two dice. Make sense? Yep. Yep. Um, beer is used to get guests, which are these cards here. And then gold is used to get uh, new staff and tables, but also to upgrade the different areas of your tab. Um, unlike a lot of uh, games with a deck building element, whenever you get a card, it goes on top of your deck. So whenever you get a card, you will draw it next round. Okay? Yep. So it, the, where we're drawing these um, patrons is any word I can think of. <laughs> When you're drawing these people, we've each got our own deck, and is it basically they start with these ones and twos, and then we're adding yeah. better people you, in, basically. Yeah, you will all start with the same deck of, I think it's uh, like two twos, four ones, I think. I mean, it's five ones. And then you have one brewer, one table, and one okay. All right. I'll tell you what those things do now. So the brewer is just a multiplier for this area. For each extra one, each dice is worth one more beer. The table gives you another place to stick your guests, to stick your patrons. The waitress lets you take a dice of your colour and roll it before you roll your white dice. And that's just your dice now. You can have as many of each of these upgrades as you want, but you can only have a three extra dice. The dishwasher just allows you to treat one dice as if it was one higher. Uh, sixes do not roll back to ones. Okay. So it's just plus one to any dice. That makes sense. Uh, you can use two dishwashers on the same dice, if you wish. Uh, then oh. there's also this beer guy. Costs two, and he's just plus one beer. That's it. Um, at the end of the game, you get points based on the, the points on the cards, which is in the top right of each card. It will tell you how many points it's worth. Okay? So... Okay. If you see here, these nobles, they're worth 10 points each. They're good. Um, whenever you upgrade a location in your tavern, so all the different locations have uh, a gold cost in the top left. That is how much it costs to upgrade them. To upgrade them, you simply just flip them, and the upgraded side is the other side. Whenever you upgrade part of your tavern, you get a noble, and that goes on top of your deck. If you draw okay. multiple nobles they share a seat. So if you get three nobles in a row, that's only going to cost you one of your tables. 
Um, so yeah, you've got a table upgrade, your um, storage can be upgraded. Any location that has uh, an, like an associated card, so for example, the waitress here or the dishwasher, you can scrap cards of that type to get a discount equal to the cost. So for with the waitresses, if I had two waitresses here, I could scrap both of them, get rid of them from my deck permanently, and it would make the upgrade only cost four gold. Or I could scrap three to make nice. it free. And that's just a permanent waitress then. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. This here is just the cash box. That's just one dice of any full gold. The monk here with a five, and you can use as many as you fives as you want in this, moves you one up on this uh, monastery track here. Um, whenever you reach a location with a symbol on it, you basically get that benefit. So this will get you a beer guy. This symbol on the number four allows you to trash a guest who is currently in your tavern. Just <laughs> bar him for life. Get out. Yeah. See you later, drunkard. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then on the eight with the crown, that's a noble as well. Cool. At the start of each round, everyone will get a benefit, which is based on the round here. Um, so in round one, you get one of these guys. Uh, they sit at your table and they can, well, they sit up the bar and you can use them either to just get plus one in the monk track or to say, I don't like this draw, take all your cards, put them in the, take all the cards you've drawn this round, put them in the discard and draw again. You can't only discard some, you have to discard them. Um, and that, you, these stay between rounds, you can just keep them for as long as you want. Uh, after eight rounds, the game's over and the player with the most points in their deck wins. Okay. Um, this eighth round benefit, that just means you get to upgrade a location of your tavern for free without getting a no. Okay? Cool. Yeah, that's it. Do we have any questions? I guess my only question I've got so far. So we said about the patrons. So mm -hmm. you start the game, you draw for the number of tables you've got. Keep going until the table is a full. Mm -hmm. Those patrons stay there between turns, even if you do hit the benefit. Uh, so Correct. at the end of at the end of the round, every card in your tavern goes into your discard, regardless okay, of whether you. or not they've been served or anything. <clears throat> um, and when you need to draw from your deck and it's empty, you shuffle your discard back into your, your new draw pile. Oh, awesome. Okay, so yeah, the benefits are trashing then start becoming more important as rounds go on. <laughs> and how do you upgrade your actual bar? There's no cost on it. Uh, you don't. That's so. The game comes with like additional modules, and that's yeah. one of them. Uh, okay, all right. Don't worry about cool. it. Right. Yeah, you need your bar flies sitting on the bar with you. Yeah, they're your locals. Yeah. Yeah, these peasants on the tables, you know, they're they're going to come and go. So I presume, I presume, right. on was it round one, four, and six, yeah. those are the three people that would then sit in those three seats, right? Yeah. Okay, exactly. Cool. Gotcha. And you just grab one of these. Um, it doesn't matter which side you put them on when you take them, you can flip them when you want to use them. So it's just plus one on the monastery or your mulligan. Nice. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Good. Um, good. So yeah. if someone wants to take the first player mug, Stein, yeah, I think. Uh, is that I, I think I'm, uh, I am red. I'm down here. Yeah. yeah. Sam's all yeah. over it. Yeah. It's um, rotten steer. It means the red bull. The red bull, also known as the best bar at the table. Um, um, so do I just know. start with turning the cards over? Yes, yeah, so everyone can do this simultaneously. It's just when it comes to resolving dice, you do that first. That's okay. first. Gotcha. All right. So if everyone wants to just keep drawing. Stop when your tables are full, even though yep. I could potentially yep. get a bar lady. Yeah, okay, yep. cool. as soon as your tables are full, that's it, you stop. Why isn't it letting me move that one? It's gone. So 
so it's having a technical glitch with that one apparently. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. All tables full. Yep. Yeah. All full. So has, has anyone drawn a waitress? Uh, no. Nope. Okay, then just roll your white dice. On the no, boost. How do I select all the dice? Uh, hold shift, Brad. Ah, uh, shift. And then just R? Yeah. And choose one to keep. Do we have to place it now, or just put it somewhere? To no, just put it, in your, put it in your tavern. You don't have to place them until it's time to resolve them. It's just whilst other people are resolving theirs, you can choose to sort of plan at that point. Okay, so pass clockwise, and then I, I didn't really swap round to round, I think. But uh, so you're receiving from a different person. Oh. Are these your dice, Chris? These are oh, sorry, yeah, I didn't realize you were the one all the way in the air. I was just passing to the left. Cool. Yeah, this, this, this tavern doesn't exist. It does, it's uh, abandoned. Closed, you. Okay. Breaking coronavirus. Okay. Um, so, what do I need the beer for? Uh, getting these guests. Getting the guests, that's it. Oh, uh, nobles can also be bought for beer. Um, there's a little chart just here, it's not super clear. But one noble you can buy for nine beer, two for 14, three for 18. Under normal circumstances, you can't buy more than one of the same thing. That is to say, you can't buy multiple guests at all. You can only ever buy one guest in a turn, unless you're buying multiple nobles. Um, and with these cards, you can only get one table. You could get a table and a waitress and a dishwasher, but you couldn't get three tables. Uh, upgrades as well, you can buy multiple of in a round if you can afford. You can't buy multiple of the same specific. So, uh, if you'll pass to the left again. Yeah. Take a mate. Cute. <clears throat> so, on the bottom left space of the board, mm -hmm. the dishwasher space. Yep. Does that mean that if I was to put a four there now, it would then turn into a five, which I could then use later for the monastery? Uh, so you don't, have, you don't have a dishwasher to begin with. If you get uh, a dishwasher, okay. you can use it. And by upgrading uh, the space, you have a permanent dishwasher. Uh, and then you put the brewery one down here, where essentially any wasted dye, you can just turn into a beer. Yeah. And okay. same with the gold box. Any any left dice can just be... Oh, perfect. That's what I was just curious about, because they weren't what I wanted. <laughs> So you've taken all your dice, so red, you want to resolve first? Uh, do I resolve everything? Or just yep. one then? Okay, so I think this means I get four beer because I've got this the extra card. Yeah. So I will. Buy the Sweet. only one I can get. Yes. Yeah. So I get three gold, so yep. two from this and one from here, which I will again earn. Yeah, I'll get the dishwasher. 
So with that extra beer, can you then put that into storage? Yes. Thank you. Uh, that's me. Okay. So I have got three beers. Good to have. This gets me a base patron. Yeah, so um, that's two for me. So for them. Else I yeah. to Some of the uh, guests have other things they get with them. So, for example, these two will give you some gold when you get them with beer, and these two come with cards. That's just when you buy them, you get that benefit. It's not a every time not you play them or every time you them. Okay. them. It's just when you get the card, yeah. a one-time benefit. Okay. okay, thank you. And that is and a then... way you can get two of the same card in a row. And then I've got four money, which I'm just used to buy myself a waitress. Yep. It goes on top of the deck, remember? Ah, thank you. Yep. In that case, I need to put this one on there first. Yep. Awesome, thank you. Okay, so I've got one beer, which I'll put into storage, and then four money to buy a waitress. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all about getting a waitress that turn. <laughs> Okay, so return all your dice to your coasters and put your all your cards in discard. Is there a way of picking up multiple dice? Like if you hold control, does it allow you to pick up multiple items at once or is it one shift. at a time? Hold shift. Okay, cool. That's what I was wondering. Do we get these uh, little barmen now? Not barmen. Uh, so that was that was at the start of round one. You should have got that, sorry. Okay. Yep. Green Thank you very much. Ready. In round two. So the first player mark is rotating. Uh, you can all either take a beer guy or this three cost guess. Should so, we all move one round the monastery track? Just. Uh... Because we would have had that. Uh, so you no, could just, you could have choose to, chosen to use that, but you can wait until you can hold on to it to use its ability later. Oh, oh is it one one time ever? One time ever, yeah. Ah, uh, okay. I thought it was onto a turn. Okay. Yeah. Right. It's because you can also use it for the mulligan effect as well. Uh, okay, so you don't get a mulligan every turn. I thought that no. would be a bit powerful. Okay, cool. Yeah. Um, okay. So uh, actually, guys, sorry, I missed once. So you'll get a free cost guest or the B either round two, and that just goes on top of the deck's norm. I'm gonna take that one. Free cost guest. Nope. <laughs> just them over the same card. So the beer guy just gives you one beer? Yeah, he's just plus one beer. <laughs> and the other one is the three cost guest, which yep. is just a three three dice. Okay. Uh, yeah. I'll and it's worth a point. And it goes on top of your deck? Yep. Picked. So this is now just a new phase. Flip over the cards. Yeah, and before. just draw your cards again. Right. A beer guy just goes anywhere outside of your thing, yeah? Yeah, I usually put him by the uh, the storage just because it's ah. like this is the beer area of the town. Yep. Happy with that. There's a waitress. In fact, yeah. last turn I just had three uh, three guests. That's true. So yeah, you had three guests, two waitresses. That's a lot of extra dice. Yep. So take two dice of your color and roll them before you roll the white dice. Okay. Ooh. Okay. And then okay. roll your roll your white dice and pass them. Right. After this before. Yeah, I like that. Thank you much. Cool. 
could need a second, guys. I'm just looking into the bathroom. That's okay. Yep. Hey, Sam, Zach, do either of you know of a quick way of moving across the board? No. Rather than zooming out. You know when you zoomed in, it's quite slow to scroll across. Uh, hold on, left mouse. Ah, oh, thank you. That's okay. That's fine. Even when you're holding something. Oh, I don't know. I haven't tried it. Oh, yeah. it's because you have to you have to move them way further. Oh, we were supposed to pass them the other way this time, weren't we? Oh well. Yeah, because yeah, um, I'm passing them so far that it's really hard to scroll up there. Oh shit! Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Fuck. Wrong button. How do you change the die face on it? Uh, I think if you right click on it, just keep rolling it. <laughs> <laughs> just keep. Rolling. That was a that was a two, and that was a five. Damn it. Two and a five. Nope. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. what, was, what was it before, Chris? It was a two and a five. So I saw what they were, went to pick up the one I wanted, and then pressed R instead, and I was like, for fuck's sake. Which one did you want? Uh, well, I actually wanted five, the monastery. Yeah, there it is. Sorry, just place it and put it on the monastery. Yeah, yeah. that's kind of stupid, stupid. Right, perfect. And one of these was a free. So why isn't that a free anymore? What have I done wrong? I, I hate my life. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah, fine. And then we just place a dice, don't we? Yeah. That was a free. It's changed again. Damn. How many beers is it for the second guy? Seven, isn't it? Yeah. That's a lot of beer. Three, seven, six, eight, six, for some reason. Mm. Yeah, so when you get one of these guests, it's you replace them with a new one from the top of this deck. Uh, okay, it's a random. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. I can get four beers quite easily. I can't get any more than that. Three, four, five, six, seven. Got seven beers. Yes. Ah, <laughs> thirsty work, mate. Can you place as many on the monastery, as many fives as you want, because it just place a place one? As and many fives as you want. Thank you very much. Yeah, so only the monastery and the uh, one in the corner can have multiple mm. things. Everything else is just one. Thank you very much. I'll do that one up there. That one down here. Oh, okay. And then, is everyone ready? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to spend my full money and discard both my waitresses to upgrade my thingy to a permanent waitress. And when you discard it, are they trashed from the deck? Yes, yeah, so just put them back on the stack for those ones. Awesome. Yeah. I have to tie it up in a sack. And when and you then, upgrade, you get a noble. Ah, oh, thank you. Yes, I do. And then he goes to the top of my deck. And then two tracks in a monastery and three beers. So I'm going to buy myself a base patron. And then two on the track. Does that get me a new beer? Or two on the track? Oh, it's one of these guys. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm done. Okay, so I've got one, two, four beers, plus one from my three, plus one from my dwarf. And then one in my storage, so that's seven beers to get this lady here. Nice. 
uh, which gets me four gold straight away. Um, so that's four gold from her. Uh, so that goes down. Uh, four gold from her plus three gold from there gives me seven gold. Um, so I am going to do a Chris and upgrade my waitress. And then these go back into the stack. Yeah. The stack. Um, I'll... I need to start another demo because unfortunately I have started this one a bit late. Um, but if you do need any help, just send me a message and I can pop back in. Yep, that's cool. Thank that's you. Awesome. Thanks, no man. No Take problem. Care. Uh, right, so hello. just to recap, are you guys still doing your uh, purchases and stuff? I'm still doing mine, sorry. Yeah, I've, no. not, I've not had mine yet. That's so cool. I upgraded the waitress. Oh no, I bought this person, which means they can then go on top of my deck, can't they? Yeah. So she goes on there. Then I spent four gold to upgrade the to permanent waitress, which gets me a noble, which then goes on top of my deck. And then my final three gold I used to buy a dishwasher. Uh, I'm good. Okay, so I get plus one there. Um, I'm plus one in this with my washer to a three, which gets me four, five gold. And I'm going to buy nice. a table. Nice. So then I'll put that one down there. This one can go back. Up to here. Okay, so it looks like we all get a washer. Hey, we all get a thingy. Card, we'll get. Yeah, that looks like a dishwasher, doesn't it? Or. Or you just change it. Oh, or this one. One of these two. Is that right? That's the same. That's a waitress or a dishwasher. So basically, another dice plus one to a dice. I'm going to take the dishwasher. Uh, so a waitress I'm, or a dishwasher. I'm taking the waitress. Cause I, didn't get, get one. I, I didn't get one when you guys got one, so I'm taking the waitress. Yeah, I'm going to take another one. Yeah. That's why, if you notice, know, I discarded both waitresses to get a permanent one. Yeah. The extra dice seems quite useful. Oh, yeah, definitely. Although, you do the same as that. Yeah, yeah. although I did yeah. have a spare yeah. dice last turn that I couldn't use for anything. Mm. I was like, you know the fuck out. Did you? <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so that's ready to go. Uh, I get the beer mug. Yeah. Um, yeah. Start flipping cards, I guess. Flip yep. them cards. I wonder what I've got. Oh yeah, waitress first. Yeah. Uh, this is the thing. Like, I already know what the deck is because I just bought the cards. Have some free beer. I've got no free beer, but I got a noble. I don't um, have enough tables at the moment, which is I know. a shame. Sam just bought one. I'm like, I'm looking at that table. I was like, yes, please. It's so handy knowing that I was guaranteed the table straight away as well. How do you... Um, okay, a more of a question about the software. Every now and then when I'm dragging stuff, it pops up with a red symbol saying no. Is that happening to anyone else? Is it just, it's probably user error. I'm just trying to work out why it's happening so I can stop it happening. I have not seen that at all. Like, when you click on something, are you double clicking and drag? Or are you always single clicking? Single. Yeah. It's happened about five, six times now to me, so I just can't work out why. I'm going to quickly run to the toilet while you guys finish. Cool. Um, done. Right. I'm going to roll my extra dice and then I'm also going to run to the toilet quickly and grab a drink. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. That's two and a five. Okay, you have it. It's, 
it's a little bit clunky this software like, you know like when you put the deck back together if you notice it's a bit I haven't had any problems it snaps in for me yeah this is what I'm finding are you guys all done? Uh, Sam's having a piss alright yeah, mine's all set I'm going to take my two dice again. Have you got two dice again as well, Sam? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Trying to work out whether I'm prioritising the, the upgrades on the board is a good idea or not. Uh, it's good, uh, well, I just upgraded the waitress, so I suppose, yeah. The storage I'm not 100% sold on, but... I think the storage is if you manage to upgrade the two brewery related items because then you start getting double beers like the one in the bottom right 18 gold and every one in six gets you two beers uh, yeah. and all of a sudden with seven dice you could find yourself with like 16 beers in a turn I have returned or well, if you upgrade the uh, actual barrel then that's one any one dice is two beer yeah, now you see where I'm going if I can this turn and how does storage work? Okay. So any excess gold, I need to be putting, putting storage because it's really hard. Like I'm looking at my cards, I need to get a one, two, three for six gold. At most, I can get seven gold in a turn right now. Uh, remember, if you buy the um, customers with the gold, that's how I upgraded my thing. I bought the uh, customer with the beer who gave me plus four gold, yeah, which means that's quite a lot to get, isn't it? Um, and then the go back, and then there's ones that give you extra beer when you buy them as well. So, what did you buy this one for six beer that gave you free gold, which you then used to be able to do the purchase? Okay, cool. Well, it was a different one, but yeah, basically. It was, yeah. It was this one. Oh yeah, the one down here. Yeah. I got four gold for buying a. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, ready to roll dice? Uh, yeah. yeah, I think so. Oh, roll, roll your own dice first. So personal dice first. Oh, I did those before I went. Double sixes. Uh, six so and a three. The, the monk can only be fives. Or is it yes. five plus? Okay, no, so they're all five. very specific. I guess I'm buying a lot of beer this time. I accidentally um, re-rolled my two colour dice and they landed on the same two faces they had. So that's and passes on, which then gets me seven money at the end of the turn, which allows me to upgrade something, which gets me a nobleman. Yeah. yeah now I've remembered why you want to upgrade stuff. Get yourself some fucking cheeky nobleman. So I'm just trying to figure out what the fuck my plan is. <laughs> do, 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 do. Uh, sometimes when I move the dice, it seems to be changing the number from moving it. Are you pressing anything while you move them? Mm -hmm. I must, but I don't know what. Oh, I think our Q and E like rotate stuff. I don't know how, how that works with dice, but I must be pressing okay. something without realising it because yeah. that was a two when I picked it up, and now it's a four. And that happened last round as well. If anyone knows how to change dice, using a shortcut on this, that'd be amazing. Just so we don't confuse it, I can carry on playing the game properly. That is always useful. Yeah. Do, do, ones back to me. So, uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, the beer. Oh my god, I'm going to be fucking swimming in beer as well at this rate. Well, I was getting shit all for the money, so I was like, well, I'm just going to go to town on beer then. Well, this monastery motherfucker, right? You know the uh, one, is that you get to use them every turn for the monastery? Or you discard it to Mulligan. That is white, isn't it? It's yeah. a discard. No, it's discard to use either way. 
Oh, it's just I'll choose it either way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll find. I've already done a monastery once. That's what I was checking. Have you got my last dice, Chris? That's right, mate. It's just questioning that. Uh, you can have a five, mate. That's why I was asking because it would have changed which dice I'm taking. Yeah. Oh. Six spears, and then that would give me three gold, which would get me another. See where this game's probably been rated well. Yeah. It's a bit fiddly on this, but I just can see why it could be a good game. Yeah. So these guys that give you plus one beer, is that like they just give you plus one beer no. in your turn? If it's on the card like that, then you get the beer card. Whereas the beer on this one is just a beer, so beer card, beer. That's plus uh, one beer yeah. for bring. Well, that's just plus one beer card. Yeah, which is. All right, so it gets you the little dwarfy guy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, I'm probably just gonna go one, two, three, four beers, then I'm gonna use a five to advance around the track. Uh, what color am I? Blue. And then I'm gonna spend my guy to once more. To then get you a beer card. Get me a beer card. Yeah. Uh, come on. There we go. That uh, dishwasher guy seems pretty bad if he only moves up one. Because the nobleman seemed like your best game to go for. Um, oh, wait, that gets me a beer card. It doesn't get me a beer, does it? No. Nope. The card goes on top of your deck as well. Oh wait, shit, that, no, that was a terrible idea, sorry. Uh, <laughs> undo, undo, undo. Undo. <laughs> nothing, of any, nothing of any use. Um, I'm going to use that to get my free beer there, and then use my dishwasher to turn that into a six, to get six beer, and then I'm going to buy this guy. And then I'll use three coins from that to buy a... Do, do, do. Just auto flip and auto fill. Oh, um. Yes, yeah, just flip it straight away. Yeah. yeah. Um, I'm gonna buy the beer guy and then take one gold for storage. And I'm done. He's not bad. Five yeah. to five. So I will spend four gold and bin the ladies to get the upgraded puppy. Gets me the noble. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally, it's just like bin the ladies. See ya. to get one gold in my storage because I can't spend that this turn. With my beer, I've got four beer. So I'll take this guy. Which moves me up the one or two track. Bastard. Yep, that's the one I wanted. And I've also got a five, which moves me up the one or two track. Which gets me a beer card. There, uh, and that goes down to zero. Spent those. Quite well, got that, got that. Um, cool. That's me done, I believe. Yep. Alright, so you screwed me. So I'm <laughs> <going to laughs> nice. buy this guy. I thought that you said you wanted him, and I'm in front of you, so haha. -ha. 
Yeah, and I've got actually but that also, final yeah. matter. Yeah, I had four beer. That was obviously yeah. the only, only beer cut four beer, so... Oh, no, like, you definitely get... Yeah. And then that leaves me one spare beer. I'm going to move my track up one. And then I've got six monies, which I'm going to use to purchase that upgrade. Which then gets me the nobleman. What did you upgrade? I upgraded the gold storage. Yeah. And then the upgrades you do gets you a nobleman. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's only six yeah. gold. Wow, okay. <laughs> yeah, now you see what I was going for. Yeah, that's a good one to get the noble. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay, ready to go again? Oh, no, we get a thing, don't we? Uh, we get another shady person sitting at the bar. So the mulligan, it's like after you've drawn everything. You just discard yeah. it all, I guess. So you then discard everything. everything. Yeah. Do we shuffle our decks once you, uh... Yeah, once you're all the way through. Uh, how do you click... Do I have to click... Shift, highlight entire stack? You've still got cards there. Hmm? You're green, right? You've still got loads of cards. Well, it's what, well if this is what I was asking, I can't... My stack's working as well as it should be. But that should be over there. And it'll be a brand new deck this turn. Oh, you're not putting them in the deck, you're just slapping them on top of each other. So you have this to, is what I'm struggling with. You have to hover over it until the, the deck underneath goes orange. A DU. Yeah. So pick up one, hover it, and then the deck will go orange, and then, you could, and then it joins them together. Annoyingly, I think the bottom card of my deck isn't. Yeah. Make a, make a new slide up. Yeah, uh, no, it'd be good to learn how to do this. Like that. You wait a sec before you let go. Okay. Yeah, I can see it. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Uh, and if they're in a stack, then you can double and get the whole stack. Yeah. Uh, okay, and that's the same with the discard pile, and probably why. I didn't know that earlier. I haven't done it each card going through. Now it's the admin. Yeah, actually, I should probably clean up my discard. It will save time. Though. Yeah, that's what I was doing earlier. So yeah. if I mulligan now, then everything on the table goes into the discard, and I just draw again. Yeah, I think so. Use your prints there. Yeah. Yeah, he'd mulligan. Mm. You can mulligan your four tables. Four yeah. tables and a beer, man. That's pretty good. Yeah. It's a very specific dice, though. I'm, I've got fuck all um, manipulation. But yeah, I'm going to take it. Yeah. There, does, there doesn't seem much manipulation. But I guess, I mean, it's drafting the numbers, right? That's the, that's the manipulation. Yeah. yeah. The dishwasher gives you manipul uh, some manipulation. Right. In fact, it's only plus one. I've got one. Yeah, you can, one, yeah. You can plus one one dice, which is not Yeah, not that's amazing, not great. But... Hey, got me my beer last time. Oh man, three free cards that turn. That was a amazing bad turn. <laughs> that was my first turn. It was like it's so depressing. Yeah. Well, yeah. You still managed to get your. You still get your blue, your um, color dice though. Yeah. Yeah. And I've ordered two. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the noble. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's when I pick up from there, I just saw it happen. When you're picking up from the tray, sometimes it gets caught in the tray, so just be careful. It's because you can't move the, uh, the underneath bit. Yeah, so yeah, that was a free, put it on my free card just to make it obvious what it was. I've never had that happen. It's weird. It's happened to me a few times. I guess it's just the fact of I'm not used to this. I'm struggling a little bit with the controls. Hmm. I wonder which dice I will take that you have given me, Zach. <laughs> it's a difficult decision. <laughs> 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 
I wonder which one that Chris will take from these two. <laughs> I wonder what I'll get back at the end. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I guess right. I'm going to take that. Have you already passed them over, Sam? Yeah. Remember, you don't have to place them on cards now. No, yeah, it's no. just picking the dice. No, it's because uh, that free one changed, so I put it on there just so it's out of the way. How have I got two fours again? Oh, man. I'm not getting any choices. Anyway. Fours are awful, aren't they? I got one which I needed at the start, now I'm like, I don't need any more. Fuck off. Yeah. I mean, they're good yeah. for like one pound and one beer. They're good dumping them. Yeah. No, that's what I'm just doing there. I suppose if you've got a dishwasher, it's a monk. But... True. Which is what I'm going to do with this one. <laughs> Good Thank you. I'll take I'm going to get that four. Yes, you are. <laughs> I wonder what I'll get. Oh, look, it's a three. Yeah. <laughs> From the four threes you got. No, I had a five at the start, which I took. <laughs> it's quite handy. Here we go. Two. Four. Mm. Eight. Eight. This is a bad turn. Uh, you've got the beer mug, haven't you, Sam? So it's yeah. yeah. <clears throat> I might as well make get myself a beer because <laughs> I've got it in storage, and then I've got advice that I can't use. Yeah, it's fucking depressing when you have a dice you can't use. It's like just. Fuck you, Dice. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of here, you. There's so many options, and why aren't you one of them? <laughs> uh, okay, so me to start. Yeah. So this is everything down here is four beer, which I will spend three on this guy, I guess. this to a5 which gets me one on the month track and I'm going to cash in both of these dudes as well to put up two more on the month track which gets me a washer puzzle hmm. is, that, is that me yeah. yep plus one beer and storage done <laughs> and financials Oh, you absolutely. can put as much money as you want in storage, can't you? Hold on, no. sorry. What, what did he say this symbol was here? Which one? Uh, on the monk track. I think I went... I cut the corner off. I didn't realise this was a space. So I'm not. That looks, like a di that looks like a dishwasher card. No, 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 this one. No, no, no. Uh, I think that's you can burn a card. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. He's right. Yeah. So, card. dishwasher goes back because I've not made that space yet. I cut the corner off. It's not clear. You go three, four, five. Anyway. Yeah. And it's not clear you get one, two, three, four, five. It's, I mean, it's not <laughs> in everything else in the circle. It's not in the circle. Take your logic out of here, Dad. <laughs> um, I don't know if it's you get it from anything or if it's like one in play. Uh, I've already started. Yep. <laughs> All right, Chris. <laughs> so you can put as much in storage as you want, can you? as long um, as there's space for it. Yeah. As long as you got space, right. yeah. That's what I'm looking at. I've got six monies here. So I'm thinking about st stashing for just accepting this turn is garbage. And buying the uh, guy. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do exactly that, to be honest. Yeah. And this turn was just shit. One turn orange. Turn orange. Cool. I have got... Two... One, two beers, which so I will put in storage, and then two, six, seven money. Uh, nice. Which, to be honest, I am going to spend six to upgrade my treasury, and then save <laughs> one, and take myself a sweet, sweet little. It's a good move, mate. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> when you realize you get a nobleman for six gold, it's quite, quite yeah, it's quite reasonable. 
and yeah, it lets you save up a bit more if you need one, if you're going for one of the big upgrades. Which is exactly what I've just done. Yeah. And I realised, yeah, if I've got two beer, then next turn, if I get any beer, I'm guaranteed to be able to spend it. So I don't have to worry about upgrading it. Uh, cool. So, so is it me, or... Yes, it is. Where's just... I like my Stein, thank you. This time we get a table or a um, beer delivery man. A table or a beer delivery man? We're going to take a beer delivery man. I'm going to take a table. Yeah. yeah, just sometimes it just pops up with the computer says no cursor. I don't understand it. Are you back on the a laptop trackpad? No, I'm using a mouse. Really winding me up, but sometimes it does that. I just don't know why. Yeah, mine's, so, been, mine's been completely fine. So. Yeah, no, it makes me wonder whether that be probably have to restart this computer at some point. Are, you, are you going? Okay. Oh, fine. I just started clicking the cards. Yeah. Sorry. So it's the table or the bit. So the six gold one or the. Yeah, yeah. Table or table. be a cart. Ooh. Ah, oh, that's a lot of free bit. Rubbish. Yeah. yeah, I just got a bad turn, so. Yeah. This might have the cracks of Wedlingberg problem where a bad turn really set you behind quite early on. I did bin one of them, I binned a one, but there's a lot of crap still on my deck, I guess. Come on, get me another nobleman. This is it. What's going on? I'm gonna want the zank unfold or two and a one. Oof. All my tables are full. Fine by me. Oh, you got a table. Oh, still poor. Yeah, I looked at it. I was like, I haven't got any table cards already. And it's 10 monies if I discard that table to upgrade to four permanent tables. So yeah, if I've got sorry, four yeah. money in upgrade plus five for that, I only need the... six gold this turn. At least you've, I mean, you've already got four beer on the board as well. <laughs> yeah. Zach's got um... rubbish. He's going to mulligan. He's going to mulligan, I think. I am going to mulligan. This is absolutely <laughs> garbage. <laughs> I saw that, I saw the blue hand hovering over the icon, I was like, yep. Come on. There's a lot of poor, poor cards here. It's like, that is a lot of ones. Yeah. Yeah. That's the one I threw away. I feel like if I've got a one, I'm definitely putting it in the beer cart anyway, not in yep. the... Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Got to focus on you. He's good. Full, full money's definitely good. Waitress, yes. I don't think oh, any more waitresses. I think having one, maybe two waitresses tops is where you want to be. You just yeah. end up with dice you can't use, really. That's what I'm thinking. Like you get they a bit. Are, they are worth victory points, though. Yeah, exactly. More dice is good. More options, more choices. I guess. Well, that's the thing. Like those noblemen are worth ten victory points a piece. Yeah. So I'm looking at it going. That is the main <gasps> thing, isn't it? I guess. Two ones. I think I'm buying some beer shit this turn. <laughs> Six on my Ooh, That was a five. And are we rolling our whites? Yep, I've just rolled them. Okay. Do, 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 uh, do. Ones and sixes. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'm getting a ton of beer this turn. In that uh, case, I'm going to take the gold dice. <laughs> and... yeah, I'm just looking at that going, you kind of force my hand a little bit here. I need twos and threes. Uh, I'm sending twos and threes down your way. <laughs> yeah. um, there is a two and a three, you can't take them both so. That's true, I'm going to pass him a two from my lot as well because I want this five. Three dots hit. Um, then I'll take the three. I'm going to take the four. I'll take two. Take one. Oh, actually, hold on. Six, six. 
three. I'll take the four. Which then gives Zach a six. Bit. Yeah. Somehow I actually got a lot of money that round. So I've just decided to change tactics and race it. Yeah, that can happen. Yeah, because I took six to begin with, and then you guys just passed using freeze, which is everything I need to get a fourth table permanently. So I was like, fuck it, take it. All right, says it me first? Uh, yeah. yep. Everyone, everyone happy? Well, nope. <laughs> yeah. You can go there. You can go down here. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's a lot more maths in this game than I was expecting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think. Move up to the cards and back down again. Slowly. Mm -hmm. I think I don't have enough to get the fourth ta the, the table upgrade like I wanted. I'm just a little bit of money short. Oh, you've got 12 gold, haven't you? Hmm? You've got 12 gold. Do I have 12? Have I done the math right? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yes, you are right. Thank you. I miscounted. Mm. Plus five dumping the table gets me 17 money overall. Which means I don't want that there. I'm going to move my monastery up slightly. Cool. Dumping the table. Oh, uh, okay, I see. Yeah, yeah I've got a fourth table. If I discard it, then it makes the upgrade to, five pounds cheaper. Similar to when you discarded it. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. So I lose out on two victory points by gaining a nobleman, which is worth ten victory points. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> so it's two, four, seven, plus five, twelve. Yeah, so you got loads of money. Yeah. yeah, that's why I said when you guys passed me the ones that gave me money, I had to change strategy quickly. Yeah. I couldn't take enough of them. Yeah, this game is odd. This game is very classic <laughs> Quedlinburg. I think it's the best. Yeah. Oh, really? It's, it's got a lot of different things in it. Like, you got the whole drafting, then the dice thing, and the. It's, yeah. yeah, it's a, it's a medley. Nice drafting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It really is. A fucking... Oh yeah. Uh, so yeah, actually, I should really actually take my turn rather than just laying the dice. Fucking forgetting, I need to do more shit. Yeah, yeah, we've sorry. <laughs> sorry, I was just about to roll a cigarette and then take the laptop outside to have a smoke while playing. I forgot I need to actually play the game. Right, first thing first. This this five, this one up here, she's trash trashing it so that's five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve plus three gold from storage gets me that flit and that then gets me a nobleman it'll go to the top of my deck hover the, hand, hover the hand over the deck not the card i said the hand there you go yeah. thank you there you go and then with my five beers I have, so two in storage, two free beers, and a fifth one. That gets me this guy, who seems better than doing a monastery card, to be honest. Like, that monastery track, probably not a good use of my time. Done. So that guy who's just drawn gets you a dishwasher? Uh, yeah. Uh, was that Sam's one, you mean? Yeah, oh, the one, that, the new card. The one I just drew. And, and then these, the, the two next to you get the beer cart. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm going to go with my original turn. Okay, so I've got one, two, three beer from a dice, plus one for the dwarf, and plus two in storage to get this guy, which gets me this guy. Uh, was it that, or did, was it a beer? Oh. Is it not? Oh. No, yeah. Because it's that card. 
it's that simple. Yeah, it's got the plus next to it and not the. Uh, they're very similar, I guess. Um, and then I've got two, six. There you go. Uh, nothing. Uh, first, ooh, eight gold. You're right, I do have eight gold, so if I put that there. Shame you guys are counting. I know, right? <laughs> that could give me nine gold, which means I'll then upgrade okay. my beer pump thing and take me a noble. I'm so far behind on the nobles. Nobles! That's the thing, though, they don't do jack shit for you during the game. Yeah, as long as I get loads in the last couple of turns. They're pretty poor when they arrive. Like they're just a two, which is the same as the fucking starter cards. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, I, oh yeah, got... but nobles can go together on tables. tables. Yeah. So now yeah. I've got three of them. My oh, goal is to see if I can get three of them the same turn, which yeah. then frees up more to be released in the rest of your place. Cool. Yep. Um, okay, so, so I've, I've got an issue on my side with the way the dice are being picked up, and I don't know what's going on. So like, I've, I've, I'll show you what I mean. Just So let's say I've got... Roll them, fine. If I then pick that dice and go to move it, it rolls over while I'm moving it, and I don't know why. So that's what keeps happening with the dice moving them, and it's getting really... I can't work out the mouse issue, whether it's a fucking my laptop, whether it's an edge issue, or what. I'm not lying, I literally cannot replicate this. Yeah, yeah no, I know, I'm but just, it's literally happening to me every time. Uh... Uh, yeah, but it's happened to me so often that now I'm like... It does seem to be every time you move that up as well. Yeah, like, click off, literally like... Like, yeah. don't select it, just click and drag it all in one. Yeah. Yeah, the six turn into the three. Yeah, I don't know. That's really weird. Uh, yep, and then this dice doesn't do it. So it's the first dice up, and then it's fine after. Pick up one of these coloured ones first, and then go... You know. Oh, what, are you thinking if I roll... Ah, oh, that might work actually. Yeah. Roll a bonus one. Move that one out of the way. Oh, my. oh yeah, now now work. Okay. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna save my turn, because so otherwise I'll forget what I'll do. Yeah, do it. So, so take your turn, so I've, got, turn mate. I've got five I've got five beer, so I'm gonna grab this lovely four lady here. Okay, top my deck. And I keep my one because I didn't actually spend it. Five, so up the monk track, and I gain the dishwasher. Dishwasher. And four money as well. Uh, five, so I got one of storage, and I'm going to get a table for five. Which hey. Moves that down to cool. Circle. And then we all get a shady person to sit at the bar. Nice. Hey. Which now that I know the monastery is pointing to face, Mulligan, that shit. Her well, monastery does get you benefits, I suppose. I mean, I've got like three things. I'm going to get a noble yeah. at the end of the game as well. I think you have to commit to it. Yeah. And because I'm being a bit flaky with it. Yeah, I have like every time it's like, oh, maybe I should do it. And so I just forget about it and don't do it. <laughs> I go, I should do this. And then I'm like, oh, I'm going to buy somebody that uses fives to get five money instead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, you, you need to have that out there, right? that's the thing. Which, I mean, you will guarantee this turn because you bought them. Which is great. That's what I mean. Yeah. Is this what we're on, round six? Round, yep, so done that. Grab your bar person. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take the mulligan first. Uh, it doesn't matter, you can flip it. I know. Just yeah. make myself uh, feel good about taking it. Then. Wash it. Ah oh, yes, free beer. Yeah, Come on, where's my nobles? Are they all in the discard pile? Yeah, right, Tris. Oh, this is a good turn. Yeah, engine started building up now. Yeah. I've 
to run so many cards this turn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm encroaching on your deck, Zach, with my tables. Fuck off, Sam. Go away. <laughs> oh, I've got another one. <laughs> Get out of my way. So you have got a million and one options. So he is upgrading a table this time. Got, oh my god, it I mean, won't, it won't end. You got? It literally won't end. There we go. <laughs> so you've got six dice and you've got six patrons. <laughs> one, two, three, four. I just drew 14 cards. Shit. Actually, yeah, I can upgrade. I can bin all those tables to upgrade for free. Because I don't need yeah. gold. It depends if you want another swingy turn like that, if you want more consistency, doesn't it? It depends how much money I get. <laughs> uh, well, I'm just, I'm if I can upgrade that brewery this. again, that's a fucking noble, mate. I'm going to keep playing the strategy, see if it works. Yeah. And... What have we got here? Five, three, four, and a one. No dishwasher. Oh, fuck you, dishwasher. Everyone ready to roll, yeah? I have to I've already rolled. Oh, the white dice, okay, cool. <laughs> okay, Zach, that three was a five. Nice. God damn it. Yeah, that, I might have to ask somebody to start passing dice if that happens, but I can't work out what's going on. So the three and, is a five? Yeah. And it's, if it's going to impact the game like that, that's... Oh, shit. I'm probably going to restart with that as well. Let's see if that can help solve some of this shit. Are the dice still good, Chris? Yeah, those ones didn't move, yeah. I'm actually watching them like really fucking hardy now. Okay. Zach, Sam, that three was a five, mate. This one. Yeah. I fucking re-rolled it into a five and now it's gone back. Maybe it's just a fuck dice. Now, to be fair, I heard some things about yeah, this yeah, software. Yeah. It's a bit inconsistent. Maybe that's... Yeah. Maybe it's a cock I'm trying to quickly grab a new dice. I put it over here. Let's fuck that one off. No, no, no matter Throw whenever you pick it up, it turns to a three. I think it's meant to be a three, maybe. Or it will always turn into a three. But if you roll that, it becomes a three. No matter what it's on. Five, three. Which is weird, because it was on a three when I rolled it, and then it's changed it to that. Yeah. Anyways. Uh, nice. What's it meant to be? Because that was actually my last dice. <laughs> uh, I started on a five when I rolled it, but now that you've mentioned that, you might be right that it keeps consistently changing. Uh, oh no, that's not my last dice. That's your last dice. This yep. is my last dice, the one that Zach just gave me. Yep. Yeah. There you go, Zach. I have a four, mate. Pleasure in business. Thanks. And then I'll take that fucking five. Oh wait, I've got a beer mug now, haven't I? Give me a map here. Okay. Nine monies, get in. Seven beer, nice. <laughs> what happens when you upgrade the dishwasher space? Yeah, I'm going to upgrade the dishwasher today. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Ah, oh, fuck, that's annoying. That is annoying. You are correct. See more on ice cream. Anyway, to stop that. <laughs> yes, it was okay, me mute my mic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was annoying because I could hear it and then I'd hear it come through your microphone and it's like <laughs> fucking get top of the fucking ice cream bag. Got it twice. All right. Okay, so I'm going to take the seven beer and buy the 
guy who costs seven beer. Nice. Gets you a dishwasher card. Which gets me a dishwasher. And then I am going to return my two beer carts. And then two, three, four, five, six gold to upgrade nice. my thingy and take myself nice. a noble. Awesome. I was two gold short of doing that as well. It was, yeah, the turn where I just drew two of them at the same time, I was like, it's never going to be this cheap again. Yeah. yeah. I was thinking that with my washers as well. But so, yeah. I've also got three tables, so I'm kind of screwed. I'm definitely going to do table one, but it would have been good to do the two washers now as well. Anyway. Uh, well, the, the table's free. So do the dishwasher as well. That's only going to cost you five gold. And you've already got five gold. I'd quite like it, actually. Uh, yeah, I'll probably do that, actually, then I get two neighbours. Uh, I'm not doing that first, anyway, but I've got two, four, six, seven, eight beer. Which gets me this eight beer. Oh, 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 sorry. Let's flip yes. over that one. Right, everyone, oh. at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, if I do this one, then I get instant four gold. So I'll take this guy. Which gets me four gold as well. That was eight bits, and that goes down. So now I've got four, eight, nine gold. Um, so if I've been two tables, that's effectively ten. So now I've got nineteen gold. And I'll spend fifteen to flip this. Do you know leaves me with four gold. And then if I've been both of these. You, you take your noble first, then. No, no, because maths, it... maths, hold on. I need to bin both of those. It costs me three gold, and I've got one left over. Okay, yeah, so I get two nobles, and I've got one gold left over, and I bin both of these. So I do get to keep my table. Cool. And I get two nobles. One, two. And I also move along the monk track one, and I'll discard my mulligan to move another one, which gets me a third noble, and that is what I've been trying to do for a very long time. Right. Trip Shoot. tables, boys. <laughs> I, I took my two. Be sharing a table next turn. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> uh, yeah, e easy my turn. I'm gonna add two beer to the stats there. Flip that for the nine money I've got, and then move the monster trap twice and dump that card. Then allows me to trash this piece of shit. Yep, that's why I trashed the one. The poor man. Oh, hundred percent, Mac. Start with so many as well. Don't he's actually cool. And I don't think I've ever, yeah, I don't think I've ever used him because the ones are a bit. I mean, yeah, they kind of, kind of garbage. Mm. And I uh, must get my noble. What are these guys over here, Zach? Have you, have you been them? What guys? There's two guys next to my beer person. They are your cards. Oh, it's, they were from the tables that I got rid of. Cool. Yep. Gotcha. Okay, right. so we all done. So we get a waitress or a beer card. A waitress or a what sign? Uh, the, the dwarf with the casket. Right. <laughs> Looks like I'm taking a waitress. One's worth a victory point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Beer is pretty good, but also one's worth a victory point. <laughs> this is round seven, yes. Yes. Yeah, Penultimate yeah. round. See, I can see this game only taking an hour if you're actually playing it. Oh, yeah, yeah then. once you know the rules and they just and don't have to do it on the fucking computer. Yeah. Oh, can I spend my one coin to upgrade my storage instead of my thingy? No. Fair enough, it's a no, but I just realised I had 10 money and I could have upgraded my storage rather than my beer place. Yeah, that's fine. That's yeah. that's why that's why I just rather than normally yes. Find a forty issue. Uh, right. Oh, barmaid. Who knew? Maple one, maple two, maple three. No waitress. Not a great turn at all, that, but. No. Tempted to mulligan, but. Fuck. Yes, yeah, so I want to. I need to dump. I need to dump her. Let's sort that out in a second. Yeah, five tables, mate. This is it. 
Live in the dream. Yeah. I think I should have another waitress coming in as well. Okay, no, no more waitresses, but that's fine. Make sure you right click shuffle. Yeah, cool. come. What's it gonna be? Ah, oh, it's a nobleman! Aha! It's more free beer, yes. Oh, you're right about those tables, man. That is... <laughs> yeah! Okay, good. this feels quite good, I'll be honest. Yeah. Uh, done. Yeah. I mean, I've got six patrons. Yeah, it's I'm pretty bad. happy with that. So, colour does? Yeah. Am I, I'm beer master, aren't I? Uh, yeah, you are. Where's the mug? Uh, I want the mug. Thank you. I'll put it right here. Ah, uh, that was a very nice roll as well for my personal stash. Happy with that. Okay, not bad. Hopefully somebody doesn't want fours. I'm passing you three fours. <laughs> <laughs> I'm passing Jack two fours. I will take the one instead. <laughs> uh, oh, I've got the janky dice now. I did swap out a janky dice already. Maybe so maybe there's a couple janky part, dice. Yeah. I've got a four here. I'm going to put it down here because it was a six when I took it. <laughs> Fucking tabletopia. Apparently, there's a couple of bugs in this uh, implementation. Yeah, just a few. Yeah. All right, and then I'm ready for your dice, Sam, when you're finished making your call. I had a difficult decision to make. <laughs> yeah, he gave me three fours. It's like, all right, cool. <laughs> Moving on. That's right. Time's going to be a lot quicker in his next pick. Yeah, you have those. And I'm just going to do that call now. <laughs> Here, Sam, have another one. God. What have and I got, Chris? You're getting another four. Fantastic. <laughs> Luckily, I've got... I've got two fours and two places to put them, so I'm not too bad. Uh, yeah, I've got two fours and two places to put them as well. But I really wish I had a dishwasher right now. Because... Yes, yeah, it's both the crap spaces. It's the one gold and the one beer spaces. But... What happens if I buy the dishwasher? No, because you place the dice first. Yeah, so fine, yeah, I can't do that. It goes on top of your deck as well, you don't just draw it. No, but you've got the uh, dishwasher upgrade card on your base, that's the one I'm talking about. Oh, you're right, what, you upgrade it and then you've got a dishwasher? Yeah, yeah but I'm guessing once I place the dice, I don't know if I can plus one. Oh, you're right, no, yeah, because I think you have to place the dice on it. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking it, as yeah. well. Uh, I didn't draw a single five. That, that hurts my soul. <laughs> Nine monies. Cool. Uh, is it me first? Mm-hmm. Cool. So... Yeah, so I'm still doing dice, but if you want to start ahead. Simple. Move around the track once. I've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten gold, so I will upgrade my gold producing machine, also known as a cash register. And I also get one, two beer, which I'm not going to spend. That is it. Yeah, those noblemen, if you don't get the numbers, they are fucking pointless. I mean, I like it, I put all three on the same table, so it wasn't too bad. How much is it to buy... So, nine beers can get me a nobleman, can't it? Yeah. Yeah, if you look on the thing at the bottom. No, but you've already got loads, right? So isn't it 18? No, no, it's uh, how much. It's not how many noblemen you've got, it's how much to buy them. So you can buy 18 to buy three noblemen at once, which is 30 victory points if you had 18 beers. Uh, okay. Holy shit, I did not uh, yeah. remember that. Yeah. Have you ever had nine beer? <laughs> I mean, this is the first round I've got it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I've got, yeah, four beers down here, six beers, seven, eight, I've got ten beers. 
think I'm, yeah, I think I'm just going to buy an Oberman. Why not? Ten points. Right. <sighs> exactly. Does Last round. Anyone remember what this symbol is? Uh, Not a fucking clue. That might be a quick Google in a yeah, second. I'll do, I'll do it now while you finish your turns. Right. Yes, that's nine beers. And then money. One, two, three, four, five, six monies. Seven monies if I want to spend seven. Which I do, because I'm going to upgrade my storage. Which then gets me another nobleman. All the nobleman. I think that's one. <laughs> I've had a very specific goal this game. Yeah. Cool. Done? Yeah, all done. Alright, so mm. I'm going to spend seven money to upgrade my beer storage. Which gets me a nobleman. Um, then I'm going to put one in my storage. And then I've got six beer. Couple of fives. I'm not gonna lie, I'm now looking at putting Four, oh, yeah. loads of storage, right? Buy that three, put three beer in storage. That's pretty good. Uh, yeah, we yeah. might have underestimated storage early in the game. Yeah. Actually, it allows so you to swing pretty pretty so big. Every other turn you get a good amount of beer. Money. Yeah, so you just swap between money or beer every yeah. round. It should be. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy the three, and then put three beer in storage. I should have a third patron. I've not mulliganed and I've only done the monastery twice. Fair did you guys remember to get the third one, or did we yeah. all miss it? No, I took it. Zach took it as well, he told us to take it. I think I just wasn't paying attention. Have you started your goes out? Or you... I started tidying up. Oh, okay, cool. That's fine. I tidied up after my go. So on turn 8, you get to upgrade any area of your tavern for free, but you don't get the label. Alright. Uh, cool, I will upgrade my table. I... Yeah, that's probably a good one. I'm going to upgrade my beer production factory thing. That's what I was just looking at. It's the most expensive, so I feel like I should. But is it actually the best move? Yeah, it depends if you're going to spend beer or not. The washer might be good one if you haven't got it yet. Just get a free plus. A free does mean play. Ah, the, the, the upgrade in Monastery would have been good if you decided to into that. It gives oh, you double movement. Look at that. 12 money and then you get double movement. Shit, I, f I forgot about the gold storage and the yeah. thingy as well for that reason. Like they're just in the middle of the board, they ignored. Yeah, I did go last turn. But... What about this one down here? I would need three to get that. Oh my god, what's. You can only upgrade this one at the bottom. Hi guys, okay. how are you getting on? I presume that's. Uh... Hey, good. We're almost uh, finished. Good. Just starting our last turn. Nice one. Oh, Chris, you can't upgrade your bar. That's the um, as advanced rules. Ah, uh, okay. That's why it doesn't have the gold cost on it. Yeah, because I noticed it had that white symbol, and the white symbol was there for the eighth round. So yeah. I thought maybe you could upgrade it as the last round. So, means upgrade. Nice. In so yeah, I'm just going to upgrade the beer factory. Cool. Ready? Uh, nice. Yes, is it me first? Yep. Think. Hey, a nobleman, who would have thought it? No, that's an absolutely awful go. A second nobleman, who would have thought it? I don't have a mulligan. Yep, I am so mulligan the shit out of that one. <laughs> Free nobleman. Woo. Oh, wait, that's a nobleman. Wait, hold up. Wait, let's see how this goes. Yeah, can't get any worse. Well, rubbish. I'm trying to work out whether I should mulligan to get rid of three noblemen. I've had an absolute Money. 
shit out. I've got so many good cards in here and I didn't get any of them. I just went pass and pass and pass and pass and done. Because money seems a bit irrelevant for the last round. There's not many victory points for gold. Well, if you upgrade stuff, you get the Melbourne then. Yeah. So that is a very good point. So I need 19 gold to try and get 20 victory points. 2, 4, 6, 7, 11, 12. Which is physically impossible. Now nah, I'm gonna mulligan it, mate. See ya. Fuck these ones. Do I can mulligan it again? Have you got more? Yeah, I haven't used any of them. Oh man, come on, get me the stuff I want. Oh no, oh no, the mulligan's about to backfire. Oh, the mulligan's backfired. <laughs> That's the thing, it could just go so much worse. Ah, uh, it did, it completely backfired. All the good cards were in my uh, discard pile, yeah. not in my deck. Even one more, if I'd have got this, I would have doubled all the beer that I'm planning to take this turn, but I did not. That's what I was aiming for. I was like, I wanted to try and get all my free beer cards and stuff. Because yeah. then I could I move for the 14 beers to buy two noblemen that way. Yeah, I was going to get the 20 victory points. Yeah. Those. Very annoying. Yeah. But... Oh well. Um, yeah, the, right. I didn't pay off. Who's, Anyways, who's Mugman? I'm going to use my mulligan again because it's the last time. Nice. Okay, why not? Well, I haven't got a whole lot going on, so it's like, well, I can't get a whole lot worse, to be honest. Two cover dice and a free beer, as well as three. So you're already on four beer. Doesn't matter who's done now. Yeah. I mean, you've lost a table as well, which is probably the worst part about that second mulligan. I know, but I had absolute garbage patrons. Mm hmm. You know, I just lost three noblemen and replaced them with one. I got a table back. Yep, this. Already better. Uh, go back. Amazing. Just draw off there, doesn't it? Fine, Zach, let's say it. Fill out the tables again. Oh, no, there we go. Oh, there it is. Yeah. That's what you want to see. Much better. There's the action. Oh, maybe not. That's alright. Mr. One. It's Mr. One! Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to discard him. Oh, well. oh man. That, that's how I felt <laughs> after Mulligan. He's like, you can't get worse. I can't believe like, three of our turns, even with Mulligans, were bad. That was like five, six goes because Zach did three. Sorry, uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy. I've got one, bad. two, yeah, three, four, five, six. I can use every yeah. dice that I roll. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. All right. All right. Roll I've it. done my personal dice. Yeah, I've already done it. Come on. Sixes. Yeah, Four Jesus. ones. <laughs> you son of a gun. Uh, Threes and fives. <laughs> No dishwasher. Okay. So I guess I'm going to take the five. Have some dice, mate. Thanks. Uh, yeah, they're all a little bit shit. Cheers. <laughs> Two, three. Ah, oh, fuck, I got the janky dice again. This is a oh, that is a lot of freeze going round here. <laughs> Zach, mate, have some freeze. Uh, I don't want to. You're you're going to get another set of them after this as well. <laughs> so that's two, three. Uh, in which case, I'm going to take the five. <laughs> there you go, Zach. <laughs> cool. I will take uh, these the, two threes. Taking the three out of principle. Uh, yeah. Taking the two. And then, have a three, son. Honestly, I've got three threes there. That was desperately awful. Not a single beer. 
Oh, that last turn was garbage. Any victory points I could have stolen, I ain't had. Two, three, four, five, ten, eleven, twelve gold. Okay. I have a dice left over. Even better. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Really amazing. Yeah. I, yeah. Honestly, I had three threes and a four, so like, I did the two dumps as they always do. I actually had an alright turn, I think. Not great, let's, but not terrible, so... Let's see how it wraps up. Everyone all finished? Everyone happy? Yep. yep. Got four money. What's the most victory points I can buy for four money? Just the barmaid, I think. Yep. Use that. Don't, don't use that. <laughs> She's resisting you. <laughs> And then beers, I've got five beers. What's the most victory points I can get for five? Just That's one from the looks of it. Guy, oh no, ah, oh, this guy, yeah. yeah. Yeah, okay. Not a great finish, but it's what it is. Cool, so I have got Five and five is ten, eleven, twelve gold. So what can you have at twelve gold? Well, I can upgrade that, which will get me a noble. So I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. So I will upgrade that to get a noble. Then I'll spend my other three gold to buy a dish pick, and that goes to zero. And then five beer, one short, getting a fucking noble. But I will buy this guy. One, no, the first noble's nine. Yeah, the first noble's nine, mate. All right. He's nope. well expensive. Yeah. My, 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 I'm sure I'm getting a noble. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely miles away, in fact. Right. Uh, my go? Yep. Yeah. Uh, I've got one, two, three, four, five beer. So I will grab. Haha, uh, <laughs> the good fives are gone. Screw you, Sam. I got two victory points for either of them, so. Timber. Get in my deck. Uh, and I've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight money. So I will upgrade my bank, which gets me a noble. And that's it. Hey, and now I think we go through our decks, get everything that's got victory points and total it. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Which I admit I started a while ago because it's probably going to take some time. Yeah. <laughs> right, we're going to go down. Oh, there you are, beer man. I really wanted you that last round. nobles you guys have got. I know Sam lent into them quite hard near the end and Zach's been yeah, casually got... building up storage all game as well. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah I've got at least six so far. Just oh, there's no pen in this one, you can't draw over the pen. Yeah. Right. Oh, TTS where I can just draw my winning score on the side. Noble. You both got way more than me. I'm just quickly just I'm just quickly putting in the app now just so I can get the scores while we're doing this. One, two, three, four, five, six nobles. I get five, that's done me. What do you have, Sam? Seventy-two. You? Eighty-three. Nice. Seventy-six. 
Yeah, the last yeah. turn killed me. Yeah. yeah, Zach's win. So what was yours again, Zach? 83. And Sam was 70. 72 for me. Uh, Sam was 8. Biscuit. Alright. Good game, guys. That was fun. Yeah.